is Oakley Carlson and the last confirmed sighting of her was February 10th, 2021. At the time of her disappearance, she lived with her parents, Andrew Carlson and Jordan Bowers and her siblings. However, it was not her parents who reported her missing. A local school principal, Jessica Swift, whose daughter was friends with Oakley's sister was the one who actually reported Oakley missing. Very bizarrely, in November of 2021, there was a fire at the Carlson home which damaged their residence. However, Andrew and Jordan did not call for help. When questioned, they said it was because they could not find their phones. After the fire, Jessica Swift came over to the home and stayed for about 45 minutes and noticed that she did not see Oakley anywhere. When she asked Oakley's parents about this, they said that Oakley was being punished and confined to her room. Keep in mind, Oakley was just four years old at the time. Two weeks later, when Jessica Swift was at their home again, she again did not see Oakley and became very concerned. On December 4th, Oakley's sister came to Jessica Swift's house for a sleepover. Jessica asked Oakley's sister questions about her. The sister became upset and said, quote, Oakley is no more. Then she said that her parents had told her Oakley had gone to live with her previous foster parents. This is when Jessica Swift calls the police and asks for a welfare check on Oakley. They went to the hotel that the family was staying in after the fire and Oakley was not there. Andrew, Oakley's father, said that Oakley was staying with his parents. However, he could not provide any contact information for them. The police reached out to Andrew's father, who said he had not seen Oakley since Christmas. Keep in mind, this is November. And then when police told Andrew that Oakley was not with his parents, he did not seem surprised. Jordan was uncooperative and refused to answer questions. When police went to the family home, there was no sign of Oakley even living there. She had no bedroom and none of her clothes or toys were in the home. The siblings, told investigators that they had been instructed by their mother not to talk about Oakley and her sister said Jordan told her Oakley had gone into the woods and been eaten by wolves. The younger brother remembered Jordan beating Oakley with a belt and confining her to a closet. He said he had been worried that his sister would starve. He also mentioned that when the fire happened, everyone got out of the house okay except for Oakley. Both of Oakley's parents were arrested on suspicion of manslaughter, but ultimately not charged. They were, however, instead charged with second degree abandonment of a dependent person, but this dependent person was not Oakley, but Oakley's sister. They failed to give their six-year-old daughter her prescription medicine for over a year. They were also charged with two counts of child endangerment for controlled substances, exposing their children to meth. Both of Oakley's siblings had extremely high levels of meth in their bodies. Both Andrew and Jordan pled guilty to the charges against them. Oakley had been raised by a foster family from the age of seven months. However, she was returned to her biological parents in 2019. Foster parents did raise concerns about her safety in her parents' care. Police believe that Oakley is likely dead, but the investigation is still ongoing.